Over the years, some interesting things have been detected by the Solar and Heliospheric Observatory. Back on the 12th of April, it was reported that something massive exploded on the far side of the Sun. Interestingly, people who watch the Sun have said that this isn't the first time this has happened. They pointed out that similar events have happened on the 14th of April, only two days later. The event was described as a massive blast explosion. These were captured on NASA's Stereo A probe. One question that was put forward is why did these two massive events happen so close to one another? Another idea is that these were caused by natural events. The first theory that was put forward was that this event was caused by a particularly large solar flare. Our sun is a giant star that can be found at the heart of our solar system. If we didn't have the sun's massive amount of energy, there would be no life on our planet. Scientists have figured out the sun is around 110 times the diameter of Earth. This means that over 1 billion Earths could fit inside the sun. This tells us then this event that happened on the sun was much bigger than our planet, showcasing just how fragile our blue marble is. The outside of the sun is over 10,000 degrees Fahrenheit. However, that's nothing compared to the core, which can reach more than 27 million degrees. NASA have said that to match the energy the sun produces, you'd have to set off around 100 billion tons of dynamite every second. Solar storms in the Earth's upper atmosphere are triggered by massive amounts of energy from the sun. If one of these storms is particularly powerful, it will take out entire power networks across our planet. What's worrying about this is researchers have said we're not ready for an event like this, and that it would cause chaos across the entire planet. Experts estimate if a large enough solar event was to strike our planet, it would cause over 2.3 trillion pounds or 3 trillion dollars worth in damage. The Micronation of Asgardia has come forward and said the following. They pose a serious threat to Earth even without the technological infrastructure of the modern age. The growth of highly sensitive and space-dependent electronic grids, signals and networks makes the task of defending this planet from the unpredictable events of the sun more urgent than ever. Asgardia is committed as a community of citizens of more than 200 countries to invest in public and scientific affairs, to researching and preparing appropriate defense mechanisms to tackle superstorms, and caring equally about all humanity as well as the citizens. Asgardia, or the Space Kingdom of Asgardia, intend to build free settlements in outer space. However, they have warned us about these outside attacks. Going back, scientists announced that a massive solar storm hit our planet. It's thought this occurred around 2,500 to 2,700 years ago, and it's believed to have been 10 times stronger than any solar storm we've experienced in the modern day. According to researchers, these solar storms did used to happen quite often. In fact, it's due to our magnetosphere that we're kept safe. This protects all life on Earth from most of the particles the sun emits. Going back thousands of years ago when this massive solar storm hit our planet, it would have caused radiation issues. Researchers have said it's important we monitor our sun and try to adapt to counter these types of storms. So what do you make of these large explosions observed at our sun? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.